Hello and welcome. I'm Mark Berenger, winemaker with Artessa Winery and Vineyards, and I'm here today with Wendy Savino, who's going to be telling us a little bit about some food dishes that she prepares for us here at the winery. Okay, now what we're going to start with is um, puff pastry. This is a Pepperidge Farm. It's the most accessible. It's easy to find. Um, and the first thing that we put on here is the Persian rice. Now, Persian rice is uh, a combination of, um, you can use either basmati or um, jasmine. Um, this is jasmine. And I spice it with zug, which is um, a, it's a Middle Eastern spice, and it's got cloves and cardamom and curry and um, um, a little cinnamon and cilantro. It's just wonderful. And then you take your salmon. Now, if the salmon has a thin piece, just go ahead and tuck it under because you want this to cook consistently. Keep it moist, and this gives added texture as well, but the spinach really keeps the moistness in the salmon. Uh, I've pre-roasted the red peppers. You lay a few red peppers on there. This gives a little sweetness um, and the smokiness from the roasting of the peppers also just picks up the uh, just the beautiful berry in this wine. The next thing that we put on the top are mushrooms. Mushrooms again, earthy, um, pinot friendly, they're just wonderful and it gives that really nice texture and um, gives a lot of interest to this meal. Okay. We have to have some wine while we, uh, we discuss it. Part. This is My the best part, part of the, the whole thing here. Okay, so now we're just going to seal this up. Um, um, do it any way you want. I'm I'm not one of those fancy schmancy people. Um, I just wrap it. I just get it to where it's sealed up. Just give it a nice egg wash. This is also going to um, promote a nice shiny crisp crust, and that's what we want. That you put parchment down because if you don't, it will stick. I guarantee you. And then it's going to be a big mess. Okay. So then this goes on the parchment paper. It goes in a 325 oven. Okay. Wonderful. But you can see what a nice crisp brown it gets. It's just beautiful. And this is the best part. Cut into it and you see the interior. Isn't that beautiful? You can see the layers in this now. You can see the steam coming from it. It's really hot. Now we're going to finish this up with um, hollandaise sauce. You can do Bernays, you can do hollandaise, whatever you'd like. I like to spice it up a little bit with um, um, some fruits of the sea. Today I've used uh, bay shrimp, but you can use crab, you can use scallops, bay scallops. You can use, gosh, rock shrimp, pretty much anything that you'd like. But this is kind of the crowning glory. It's just so buttery and yummy and beautiful. Chicken. Thank you so much, Wendy. Thank you, Mark. I really, I love working with you. I, I love, love working at our time. Absolutely love working with you, too. This is fantastic. So Thank let's you. Take in and take a bite. Mm. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, cheers, everybody.